Hey everyone, David and Joy and Ryan here from Sunday Sounds. Today we're going to do a five minute sound design challenge and it is going to be brutal and dreadful and tough and hard and fun and awesome. So we're going to spend five minutes and each of us are going to use Patch Builder and Sunday Keys to design a patch for the song Who You Say I Am. This uh, song has some really cool parts and like kind of some specific parts so we thought it'd be really fun for each of us to take a little time on our own and just see what we can come up with in five minutes or less. So let's go check out the five minute sound design challenge. All right, so who you say I am. I uh, know I'm gonna need a big piano right in the front of everything. So I'm gonna open up Patch Builder and put that in section one. So add in a blank patch and we're gonna use Patch Builder. We're gonna throw five different layers together here. I'm gonna start in section one. I always like to have a piano. And I really like the smash piano, so I'm gonna put that in there. So I got a few piano options here. I really like this balanced piano. That's kind of become my favorite. I'm gonna try the worship piano too. I know I need a piano. It's gonna be the bass sound, so section one, piano. I want a compressed piano, so get the balanced piano here. Smashed piano. That one cuts through just a little bit more. And for second section, I'm gonna do a pad. I think I'm gonna do this worship pad. Let's see. What's this? Yeah. For second sound. I'm gonna use a pad. I, I normally have a pad in the second slot. My go-to is warm pad one. It's a nice, just basic warm sound. Uh, let's just grab a pad. So. And I'm gonna try out another pad that I like. This big bright pad. And I think I wanna use it as part of the lead. I'm gonna make it get brighter. Let's grab another pad. Something that can be for these bigger moments of the song as like the bridge builds up and all that stuff. It's a little bit too, too deep maybe. There we go. I'm gonna want some kind of a synth lead to lay on top of that piano. Megafun or cheesecake is probably what I'm after. Here's Megafun. It's too much. Too much, too much. I'm gonna go with the cheesecake lead. Kinda, kinda goofy, but it lays really nice with the piano. There's a low battery on the Mac here. So hopefully, oh, it'll be all... Ta-da! <laughs> Joy, how much time do I have? Got three minutes. Oh, we're doing so good. So good. <laughs> okay. That's, that's one, two, three sounds. Number four, I'm gonna throw in... An arp, yes. I'm gonna put an arp here in section four. That's, that's pretty cool. Let's try this one. This one's got more more brightness, like a gritty, airy thing to it. but I think I can dial the modifiers in. I'm gonna throw a bass in here. Maybe the synth bass. So I want a, a chord art, so poly chord art. Let's see. Um, lastly, let's add some bass. Sub bass is my meat and potatoes right now. Uh, I need one more, so I'm gonna go with a bass patch here in the extra section. Let's go with the synth bass. Yeah, it's got a little bit of that growl to it. I'm gonna combine these and then <clears throat> shift the layers because I want the uh, big bright pad to just be at the top. Okay, so let's combine all of these together. New patch from selected patches. 
I shouldn't get penalized for the spinning beach beach ball. You're doing good. You got lots of time. You got two oh, minutes. Okay, got two minutes. It's solid gold, my man. Oh no. All right, we're gonna name it. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Because I'm gonna I practice with a preach. You say I am. Got it first time. Man, this is intense. Five minutes goes by really fast. <laughs> so I've got to get it dialed in like to a starting position too. All right, all right. So now we get to dial in the modifiers. Big piano, I want octave, and I want big on. Oh, oh, there's a drum pad underneath here. Watch out. All right, I'm going to cut down some of the reverb. Cheesecake lead and just make it in the lead area. Here we go. Low key, high key. There we go. And then we're gonna start with the arc out. How much time do I have left, Joy? 20 seconds. Oh, yes. He's in the sweet spot. Haven't even tried it yet, but we're gonna do it. Alright, here we go. So this is a quick demo. Yes. Alright, here we go. the tone knob to really bring uh, uh, bring the EQ up on that so it's brighter. Maybe in our big, like really big bridge at the end. Cool. I think I even finished 20 seconds early. Oh, you so got to the layer. Like, like, a couple bonus points. Very good. Bonus <laughs> points awarded. yourselves? Any realizations? <laughs> Five minutes is fast. Five minutes yeah, goes by so fast. not enough time Okay, all. okay, wait. Joy and I were like so impressed that you got into like editing so range and then, yeah, you guys, I was, you guys were, were quick and speedy. I like barely got to saving my file in five minutes. I spent too much time with the modifiers. Also, why am I the only one who needs the chords? <laughs> <laughs>
because uh, I've played that song just a bunch of times. I no. do. I've played it so much, we know each other really All right. well. Well, it, it was hard and pretty, like, really fast, um, but super cool that we were each able to figure out something that could totally work. Like, would I have loved another five to 30 minutes? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but in five minutes, I, I still feel like I could take that on stage. Yeah, That's pretty cool. Right. So, like, also what I thought was really interesting now is to look back and see, like, the things that we all had in common mm -hmm. versus some of the little differences. So I, I loved the way that... Joy, you put a pad up in the right hand only, so when you played that lead part, the pad got like more powerful, but it was still felt just like a pad. Mm -hmm. And then sort of a different approach that had sort of the same lifting effect, because when you put that lead sound in the right hand, I kept everything wide open. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't hear you. I, had, I just had a couple pads and I threw an arp in there <laughs> okay. for the bridge. The arps were sweet. Yeah, like, I love how you guys did with the arps. Like, there's oh, the different, yeah. like, different sort of moments or textures, but still filling a lot of the same space. So it was it's definitely fun mm -hmm. to see some of the similarities and the differences. So we'll put a link in the description of this video to the full five minutes from all three of us. So you can see me play wrong notes. You can hear us like, just like try and do everything we can with all of it on the line in five minutes only. So check the links in the description where you can view each of the three of us in our full five minutes. And there'll be a link in the description to Sunday Keys so you can check it out for yourself. Guys, thanks for playing along with this. It was fun. It was great. I really appreciate you being game. Thanks everybody. Have a great day. Bye. Hey. That duck should just be in every video from, yes. this, from this trip. I'm going to come back for him later. So oh. come out of my house. All right, we ready? All right. Cool. I can't believe you got into like layer range editing. <laughs> yeah, that was, We're snapping. That was, <laughs> boom. Um, and bring that second pad in. What is wrong with this keyboard? Don't apply for no song. <laughs> Do we get a vote on uh, who's the best? <laughs> You get a five out of five. Is there a prize? There's no prize. Oh. <laughs> okay, Ryan, you're yeah. up, my man. I'll pull up the cords. Top that, you son of a gun. <laughs> <laughs>